Ready, set, go. I'm out here on a Saturday. I should be waiting on the bus. The bus I want to catch is going toward, toward downtown. They're going. I guess I'd probably say I'm out here to kind of give myself some peace of mind. Because for one, I don't want to be bothered with my family. And I'm slowly getting tired. And you know what the weirdest thing is? Even at me writing a book, my family's in it. Strangers. What happens on the street? They're a part of it. Can't always walk up to a person and say, Oh, can I use you for a part of my book? Doesn't that sound kind of weird? That's like I wish I could. Just kind of Facebook everybody and let everybody know. Yeah, I'm wearing my blues hockey hat. I also got a cardinal hat too. Anyway, uh, not to hold that uh space. Like I said, I would rather probably, I would rather be hanging out at a person's house. Right now, I don't have wheels. And whose fault that is? Mine. Can't complain about anybody. I'm sorry that I kind of wrecked my sister's car. Kind of wish she had just took the initiative to start driving herself. Then instead of getting mad at me because I was driving. Everybody wants to call me arrogant. And I looked up that word. Because you sometimes have to refresh your memory. And it came out to, let me try and mentally get back to that definition. An exaggerated sense of one's, one's own importance and abilities. Okay, I got that right. And you know what I want to say on that? If I'm a son, follow this. If I'm a son, an uncle, a brother, and a grand uncle, then my my importance is just in those facets. Grandson, cousin. If I know something more than you, you shouldn't fear that, nor should you resent that. I got a lady that I haven't seen in about, oh, more than a couple of years. And coming up this, what, July? Her dad will be gone officially 10 years. I actually liked it here. And what? I rode the Chippewa bus a couple of days ago. And realized the church that he was shepherd at has been brought down. I hate that. I really do. Maybe one day somebody can hold on to the title again. Because there's only, or well, maybe that's wrong. Because there was only one Christ temple on the rock. Just like there was only one Church of Jesus Christ apocalyptic faith. B.L. Parker, pastor. I remember her too. 
right now in this pandemic. My Lord was talking about things that's going to come upon us. And I used to be a, a real strong church member back in the 90s. I tried at least to go there at least three times in a week, if not two. Let's see. Mm. Bible study. If I didn't go to Bible study, then I would go to uh, Sunday service in the morning and sometimes in the evening. Huh. Sometimes I was dragged along, especially if you got in the bus or like the late Bertie Parker did. Once I was in the van, I was in the van. She was not going to do those turnarounds. We were all going to where she was going, and that was it. And since I'm giving out shout-outs, God bless them all. Bertie Parker, the late Pastor Kirksey, the late Pastor Mimi Gray. It's nice to think about when they were all good in their own way. It's nice to think about good people. Okay, where am I going? Maybe that's another thing I need to be thinking about. Um, but I am writing a book. I need to add this to it. And right now, I'm in the park on a park bench, not waiting for the bus, but eating my Chinese. I was actually glad Golden House was up, open. I called them like two days ago, and I couldn't get anybody. And that was like being cut of about a week before that. So I had to walk down there and find out if they were serving any food or was open at all. I'm glad, yes to both cases. They were open and they were serving food. Usually my, I get my favorite high braised chicken, boneless combination plate, or I get a plain St. Paul crab sticks plain fried rice. I know I'm going to have to add more to my uh, plate because I did have beef and broccoli and I do like the mixed vegetables so I'm going to have to improve on that. Left eye is not exactly wanting to play right. I'll get ready to go in in a few moments. I have thought about going back to Transformation Christian Church. I don't always get in like I want to, if anything. As of late, I've been going to work and really having a hard problem. Let me get ready and go.